<laughs> okay, so um, a few weeks ago, I was kind of pissed off about being dropped by my therapist. I don't know. Yeah, I was angry for a little bit, but I decided to get over it. Whatever. There's nothing I can do about it. Being pissed off isn't gonna make it change, you know. And, uh, so, whatever. Moving on. I'm gonna find a new therapist, eventually. When I can afford to go back. Um, but, uh, got some questions. And, uh, I'm gonna answer those. Uh, the first one is, when did you realize you were trans? Uh, I think I covered this a little bit before, but I was really young. Uh, three, maybe? Like, the first thing that I remember, like, I didn't know, obviously, what transgender was when I was three. But that's when my brother was born, and I had already... Uh, liked boy things more than girl things, you know. I wanted trucks and G.I. Joes and Legos. Well, Legos, they're now for girls too, but, you know, in the 80s they just had, they were geared towards boys. But anyways, um, like, my brother was born and I was really upset because he had a penis. And I wanted them, you know, because my, my mom was like, you don't have one of those because you're a girl. Your brother has one because he's a boy. And, you know, I remember telling her, that I was like, no, I'm a boy. Where's my penis? And I was really upset. Like, you know, we were, we were really religious. And I was like, <laughs> being a little kid. Pissed off at God because God forgot to give me a penis. And um, along with that question, a uh, person that sent it said, um, I don't feel as much like a man because I didn't know as a kid and I don't have a buzz cut or that, you know, I'm not overly manly. It's like, you don't have to know when you're a kid. Like, you... T some kids don't, you know... You don't have to know when you're a kid to be transgender. There's no rules saying that. And you don't have to have a buzz cut. You don't, you know... Cisgender guys, they don't all have buzz cuts. Some of them have really long hair. Some of them wear makeup. It, it doesn't really matter. Like, if people give you crap about that, then that's their own issue. There's, like, there's no one way to be transgender. Just, like, there's no one way to be cisgender. It, it just... <laughs> don't let, like, stereotypes get you down. And, um, another question is, uh, how do you deal with hate? I honestly just let myself be mad for a couple of days. Like, yeah, not out in public, not around my friends. I'm just not just like, Rrr, pissy mood. I just, like, listen to music, really, like, heavy metal, sometimes Eminem, whatever. Just really angry sounding music. Until I work through those angry feelings. But, like, event you, you don't just sit there and be mad forever about things, you know? Because that's really not good for you. Um, you just, you know. But, like, also, don't just, like, yeah, it's okay, whatever. Sometimes you just have to be mad. But, like, eventually get past it. Go through your madness and get to a better place and, I don't know, meditate or something. I don't meditate, I play video games, <laughs> but whatever. Um, and, yeah, that's pretty much all I had to cover for this week. I've just been, uh, as far as personal life goes, uh, 
I've just been trying to figure out more uh, different ways to make some money because eventually I am going to get on testosterone. Uh, going to be going to Planned Parenthood in North Carolina, which is the state over from where I live, and get on tea there. Um, I did actually find a clinic that will give me tea uh, without a letter if I am already on tea. And so my plan is to drive to the clinic that doesn't need a letter, get on tea, you know, maybe, you know, maybe go once or twice there and then come back home and start going to the local clinic and get on tea there. Uh, it's, um, probably going to take me a couple months to get all that worked out because obviously it's like going to be like $150 for the visit plus I think the fact that like my insurance doesn't totally cover it so it'll probably be like a hundred to 150 dollars so that's like 300 dollars before gas and travel expenses and whatnot so uh hopefully though i'll get that all worked out in a couple months like you know and wait till after the holidays um so yep yeah. how's everything that's going on right now um like i said uh if you want to ask me any questions, you can leave them in the comments below, or you could message me on Tumblr if you want it to be more private. Okay. Mwah.